Hello, Patrick Walchuk here with an update on the multi-unit investment market in Ottawa to the end of March 2023. And if you enjoy getting these videos, hit the subscription button, notification bell, and we'll get them sent out to you every 30 days. So as we always do, we break this down into buildings that have two, three, and four units in them. In our world, we call that multi-families. And then we'll show you the larger buildings. So anyhow, uh, getting right into the multi-units, we've had 19 of them sell year to date compared to 40 last year. That's a decline of 52%. The average price is $924,000, a decline of about 12%. And in terms of how long it's taking properties to sell, they're selling in 73 days uh, compared to 44 last year. So let's take a look <clears throat> very briefly at buildings with five or more units in them. There's been one sale, one compared to 12 last year, so let's not even get into it. Um, the only comment that I want to make about not only this slide but the previous one is that there's currently um, what I perceive to be as a huge disconnect between what sellers expect to get in their multi-unit property and what buyers are willing to pay. And that disconnect has somehow got to come together. This, this won't last. This won't last. You know, we typically have 24, 25, 26 buildings sell in a year. So either sellers have to reduce their expectations or as interest rates hopefully moderate in the coming 18 months, uh, will allow buyers to come into the market. But right now we're looking at buildings where it'll typically take 50 to 60% down payment to break even. That ain't sustainable.